You're listening to Independent TV7 on the headline Tenumbu to Tribuna Article PDP Confused. Now, the, the verb or adjective or pronoun me I'm saying there is the confusion that confused, which the headline says Tenumbu to Tribuna. Now, Atiku, comma, PDP confused. But on that narrative, let's see what, you know, it expresses. Yeah. The People's Democratic Party, PDP, and uh, its presidential candidate, Alaji Atiku Abubakar, are unsure of what they want from the presidential election petition tribunal, which is the PEPC. President Bola Amir Tinumbu has said, President Tinumbu, in his reply to article and the PDP's final address, said this explains their contradictory prayers. Okay, contradictory prayers. Now, uh, the flag bearer, uh, the flag uh, bearer of the All Progressive uh, Congress (APC) was uh, declared the winner of the February 25th election after scoring 8.7 million votes. Uh, dissatisfied uh, with the election outcome, uh, the PDP and Abu Bakr and Peter Ovi, the Labour Party LP candidate, are challenging Tinumbu's uh, victory. According to the Electoral Act, the tribunal has 180 days to determine the petitions, meaning that the court is expected to round off all its activities or on before September 16th. Replying to Atiku and his party's uh, final address, Tinubu observed that they were praying the court to void the outcome of the presidential election on the ground that he allegedly failed to secure 25 percent votes in federal capital territory Abuja. But in the same breath, uh, the petitioners uh, want to be declared winners despite uh, scoring less than 25 percent. One of the major reliefs have uh, been claimed by the petitioners uh, in one breath is that the first uh, petitioner article uh, who polled only 16.13 percent of the votes cast at the fct is entitled to be uh, returned as president of nigeria okay in another breath uh, the same petitioners in a recap i'll say one of uh, the major reliefs uh, being claimed by the petitioners in one breath is that uh, the first uh, petitioner article who polled only 16.13% of the votes cast at the FCT, which is the Federal Capital Territory, Abuja, is entitled to be returned as president of Nigeria. Okay. <laughs> in another breath, uh, the same petitioners are urging the court to nullify the election of the respondent, which is Tinubu, on the ground that the respondent who polled a higher percentage of 19.76% of the votes cast at the Federal Capital Territory Abuja uh, did not score 25% of the votes cast at the same FCT Tinubu said. Now, he added that having presented contradictory and uh, mutually exclusive positions before the court, the petitioners are uh, tacitly or tactically uh, admitted that it is unnecessary for any presidential candidate to poll 25% of the votes cast at the FCT in order to be declared the winner of the presidential election. Now, once he meets uh, the constitutional requirement of 25% of the votes cast, uh, two-thirds of the states of the Federation and the Federal Capital Territory, Abuja, uh, which by the provision of uh, Section 299 of the Constitution is taken as the 37th uh, state. Uh, this is aside from the fact that the petitioners have no grantable relief before the court. Hmm. In the reply filed for the president by his team of lawyers led by Chief Wali Ola Nikbekun, senior advocate of Nigeria, he also argued that the petitioners uh, in their final address abandoned their petition by failing to urge anything on the court as required. Now, according to him, such evidence of abandonment is reflected and pages 1 to 40 of the petitioners, a written address, particularly page 7, where four, or where four issues have been formulated, okay? All are uh, concentrating on the uh, whimsically alleged non-qualification or wrong return of the respondent uh, without any issue formulated during or urging the court to make any pronouncement in favor of the petitioners and uh, pages 36b uh, to b38 
uh, where the summary of the entire address is done under four compartments that is a b c and d each of which relates to or concerns the respondent uh, without any higher author of uh, supplication for or on behalf of the petitioners now the president added a uh, word has been presented before the court is uh, devoid of any relief a plea a uh, request prayers or entreaty uh, for or in favor of the petitioners see the way they write this constitution i don't really understand but i can understand what they mean or what they are meant or what they, are, what they meant or they're about because the president added what has been presented before the court is devoid of any relief now in fact no single submission in the petitioner's address has been made in aid of any entitlement or relief for the petitioners arising from the foregoing uh, since none of the issues for determination seek uh, the court intervention that will lead to any judgment granting any relief for the petitioners particularly the first petitioner now and more particularly in respect of his wish to be returned as president or for a rerun of election oh my god etc etc so they should rerun the election now in articles form and void says uh, we submit that the resultant effect is that all those reliefs are deemed abandoned may we advance this argument further yeah? well by parity or reasoning uh, founded on judicial precedents uh, or precedents that it, that the issues of uh, determination must uh, relate to grounds of appeal and any ground of appeal from which no issue has been formulated now is deemed abandoned <laughs> so they'll keep adjourning the case say it gets abandoned i don't really understand nigeria my country now, furthermore, he said he argued that does all reliefs or prayers in the petition purportedly envisioning any supplication of a prayer to the advantage of both petitioners are deemed abandoned or have become moribund or orthiosis. You now go kill yourself with all this uh, narrative. But when it comes to government, I believe uh, it's beyond what we think or what we believe because some persons think party system or uh, being a governor before does not mean being a president you think like a governor mm -mm. it's a very different ballgame entirely you're contending with international organization international relations public management public administration so on and so forth so if you are not intelligent or as far exposed on or rather you must attain some height before you can become the president so Rigging election, not rigging election, but let's see where that will lead us to. Even in the very unlikely or remote event that any of the issues formulated in the address is resolved in favor of the petitioners. Now, it cannot translate to any eventuate or eventual of the grant of any relief in their favor. Nigeria is Nigeria. They have so many effects change your style another style they'll give you this style today they will change it they'll tell you i mean those that call themselves the leaders they represent nigeria as part nigeria but we are nigerian citizens we know nothing the only thing we know is that let's keep watching god will judge well this is why i'm going to draw the curtain i like to share your views in the comment section don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel thanks for listening and god bless you um